against an efficient performance. I know you're a field guy. How did this one go? Yeah, I thought, you know, the ball didn't come out of my hand great overall for the entire night. But, um, you know, I think uh, a few things I, I have to work on is ang still angling the ball downhill, get the ball downhill early. Um, you know, with that said, the field did improve as the game went on. I'm not going to sit here and, and, you know, say that didn't come out well. I thought it, it did come out well as the game went on. To start off, it was, uh, you know, not as good as I wanted it to be. But, um, you know, some things that I can improve on moving forward. Talk about dropping down the mm -hmm. last five starts. It seemed like you dropped down even lower today. Mm -hmm. Was that more of a conscious effort? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, just to try to change the angle on the breaking ball again and, um, you know, and the creativity and try to see how creative you can get when you're, um, you know, in certain counts to use that to my advantage. And I think it's something that, you know, I have really good feel for and, and uh, you know, having that creative freedom here uh, to do that gives, gives – uh, you know, a good feeling when you're out there, when you have those moments when you can do that. Did it feel like that? Um, as like I said, as the game went on, the, the feel started getting better. Yeah, I think there were a few pitches that uh, you know I left out there with with a couple of O2 counts that you know um, unfortunately I didn't execute. And uh, again, those are just a few little things. Everything needs to be you know really tightened up as we move on down here through September. And as we know, uh, you know things get. Uh, amplified and, and you want to be able to you know be as close to perfection as you can be so I think that's one thing that you know here we were fortunate to uh, obviously have a great game tonight and uh, continue to keep playing like there's no tomorrow. You said it felt better as it went on yet early you were really really good didn't feel that way until later? Yeah probably you know around the third inning I think the the feel started coming around and it was much better in the third and fourth and, and fifth and sixth inning um, but sometimes it, it, it's that way um, you know I think uh, you know just to continue to to, to make pitches though and, and put the onus on the hitter and, and continue to attack and you know a big thing is, is getting ahead and throwing strikes and that was one thing you know the first couple innings I just kept telling myself was just you know get ahead and um, just continue to attack the hitters. As a group, how much did you need this tonight? Yeah, it was. Yeah, we did. Well, obviously, we we definitely needed a win. Um, and just the play was tremendous. Taylor, uh, you know, the play that he made out and left. Um, uh, Turner, the play that he made at third. Uh, obviously, Yasmani behind the dish was great. Um, you know, the effort from Maddie out and right. Everybody, you know, that was the thing that I was really, really impressed with was just the way that we played defense tonight. I mean, obviously, you know, we put up a bunch of runs and, and we're capable of doing that every single night. But, you know, the defense was sharp tonight and that was a lot of fun to watch. Perfect game through four. Were you thinking about the possibility of sending your D Mountain jersey to Cooperstown? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I wasn't thinking about that at all. I was just, you know, I was just happy that, uh, you know, the ball was coming out of my hand better as, as you know, those innings were going on. But... Yeah, that would have been that would have been something. Are you gonna wear D Mountain for the rest of the season? No, that will not be. This is only for this weekend. <laughs> yeah, and it's over. <laughs> yeah. Last, yeah. last start, um, you, know, you get behind a little bit and kind of like mm -hmm. tonight, you know, they get ahead, get some runs for it. As you mentioned, the ability to experiment or drop down more is that what this situation allows when you kind of Reggie, up, you know? uh, no, I don't play I don't pitch to the I don't pitch to the score at all. I mean whether it was zero zero or, or you know, whatever the score is, I go out there and pitch my game and uh, make sure that again the creativity is something that I try to you know tell tell everybody who who will listen is it something that you know you need to have as, as a pitcher and and you know understand if, if the moment is calling for that and you know you feel and you step up maybe you have to step off and and you know buy into it but you have to be 100 percent bought in and and um, you know with me I'm able to spin the ball from multiple angles and I'm going to take advantage of it you had a great at bat too oh <laughs> yeah yeah I closed my eyes <laughs> yeah 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 I know I can Tell the guys in here that for. <laughs> do you ever close your eyes, or do you just pray? No, no, I, I predetermined swing, and <laughs> you know he, you know, hit my barrel, so I was, I'll take it. Fair. All right. Thank you.